I've got all the fit on the slots to my liking. Uh, next step is I want to take the other tube, the, the skinnier one, and I need to cut this into little short pieces that are going to fit into these slots right here. So you can get an idea how long to make them. Now if they're too short, that's fine. If they're too long, they're going to hang over the edge, kind of just like that. And we'll, we don't want that. We do want them a little bit shorter. Um, so I'm just going to eyeball it right here. And I'm going to cut these using the same technique that we did before. Just put the blade on there and roll it forward. You can see I kind of straddle it with my fingers so that when it does snap, the little piece doesn't go shooting around. Okay, so there's my little piece. And as long as it fits into that little slot, you can see it's a little short, but that's fine. So that's one, and I need two more like that. There's the second one. And that one looks pretty good too. Need one more. And that one's fine as well. Okay, so these I'm going to need some thick super glue. Here's my thick super glue, and I'm going to, my bottle is running low, so I'm going to start getting it flowing down to the bottom. And so I'll just lay it right here for right now. Um, the, the, the little post that we just did will go through that little hole on the support arm. And it's going to rotate up and down on it. To assemble it, we want to come in from the bottom side. The bottom side is the uh, side with the extra um, supports. So we want to come in from the bottom. Oops, it fell out. It's okay, you'll get the hang of this. So come in from the bottom, go through the slot, and then rotate upwards so that the, the little tooth is flat up against the surface of the, of the hub. So then from the back side, now I'm going to put some glue on here. And when I put the glue on, I, I want to keep it away from the support arm because if the glue gets in there, um, it's going to lock everything into place. And then the only thing you can do is go out and get some super glue um, dissolver, um, super glue remover, put that on there, and then after it softens, to scrape it away so that you can get it to rotate back again. So I want to put most of the glue just here on the outside by the, um, the ed end, end of the little post. And let's see if it's ready to come out. Yeah. So it's coming out now. And I'll do the other side. So as you see, I've got it just on the very edge. And now I'm going to spritz it with the uh, accelerator. And that will lock it down into place. So that's one. Take that off. And just double check, make sure it still rotates up and down. So that's good. So here's the next one. Again, you'll put it through the hole. It'll come in from the bottom side. So I'm on the bottom side. I'm going to plunge down through it. Get the little post to sit inside of its little seat right there. Swing it upwards. Lock everything down. Push down with your thumbs. And then glue it into place. Okay, that's number two. And it still rotates. And this will be the third and final one. So this is what it looks from the top side. See, I, I put it in from the bottom, rotate it, make sure you push down, and then glue it into place. So our 
hub is now basically complete. And we'll, in the next uh, step, we'll go ahead and start assembling the nose cone.